Hey guys, welcome back to the Groundbreak Games tutorial series where we're using the Paragon assets to learn a little bit about Unreal 4 Engine. Uh, this is the third video in the series. Uh, we've set up a character to use the motion controls from the third person character template and added a left and right swing attack from the Paragon attack animations. And so I found um, an easy and quick little way to add a awesome weapon trail to the sword when we swing so we'll do that next and just try to keep these videos short and segmented so if you ever need to come back and, and uh, learn one specific thing again it won't be a two and a half hour long video to sort through so that's all we're gonna do in this video and it should be pretty quick and easy so the first thing that we do need to do is open up the um, the montage that we set up and we're gonna have to add a notify to each one of those so um, if we come into the Quang character into heroes and then into his animations again uh, and if you are ever lost and wondering where I'm at you can look right up at the top here and here's the file path that I'm at contents the Paragon Quang characters, heroes, Quang animations. So um, we should have some montages down at the bottom, left attack, right attack. Go ahead and open each one of those up real quick. Oh, you can only open one at a time. So just open one of those and then at the uh, pull your menu down at the bottom here. And we'll just pause it. All right, just roll down to the notify section at the bottom. You're gonna right click, add a notify state, and you're gonna go down to trail. And you can drag that across the whole swing if you want, or just a portion of it if you want. Hit save, then we're gonna go to left attack Go down into the notify section, right click, add notify state again, and then another trail. So then we're going to go into content, back into the Quang character, uh, into characters, heroes, and then into animations. Oh, I'm sorry, back into Quang and then Meshes and then open his skeleton. And we need to get the socket names of the sword itself, uh, which is FX Weapon uh, Base and Tip. And as you can see, the sockets are set on either side of the sword. So it's going to play that trail animation particle uh, from one socket to the other socket. So now that we know the, the names FX Weapon Base and FX Weapons Tip, we can go back to our Notify, click on the little Trail Notify, and then we're going to set those two sockets in here. So here's Weapon Base and Weapon Tip. And then in the, part of the PS template at the top that is Particle System Template, uh, we're going to look at uh, trail. Just type in trail and you should see Quang primary trail. And we're, so we'll set that. Now I'll go, oops. Going to go back into animations. Open up the right attack. Drop down into Notifies, click on Trail, and do the same thing again. FX Weapon Base, FX Weapon Tip, then open up the PS template for Particle System, and uh, you're going to type in Trail again and the Primary Trail. Save. And now when we play and do our combat swings, there should be a weapon system trail playing. And 
there you go and stick around for the next video and we'll do some more cool stuff